Week nine of the fantasy football season. He has a few running backs that have his sleeper options this week. The first back, Roshan Johnson of the Chicago Bears. So Johnson, he's had a decent couple pop games here and there where he got some goal line work for this Bear team. In the last couple weeks, week five versus Carolina, and 10 carries, 25 yards, two touchdowns. Week six versus Jacksonville, five carries, eight yards, two catches, 25 yards. And week eight at the Commanders, two carries, six yards, and a touchdown. So like I said, he's locked in his short yardage and goal line back is Roscon Johnson and a pretty decent receiver out of the backfield. I know DeAndre Swift the last month of the year, he's been an elite running back in fantasy football where obviously they're not going to take touches for the most part away from Swift. But this week, a good matchup at Arizona could be a potential shootout. They give up the six most fantasy points to running backs on the season. And I think Johnson as a deep sleeper is an okay option available in 87%. Of fantasy leagues. Next running back is Julia McLaughlin of the Denver Broncos. So this week could be a game where they're trailing early and often, and he's going to come in a lot. Is McLaughlin is the passing downs back, and we saw last week he found the end zone on a nine-yard catch. So McLaughlin, he's had a couple good games here and there this season, but for the most part, this backfield hasn't done much for this Bronco team. Week six versus the Chargers, three carries, eight yards, two catches, 17 yards. Week seven at the Saints, four carries, 35 yards, and then last week. Eight carries, 47 yards, a catch, nine yards, and the touchdown, like I mentioned. So this week, the way the game script might go for this Denver Bronco team, and they got to play catch-up. McLaughlin will be on the field more and get more touches, I believe, in this game, and especially on passing downs at the Baltimore Ravens. And the third and final running back out is the sleepers, Ezekiel Elliott of the Dallas Cowboys. So I know it looks like Rico Dotto is going to be back in this game be the starter once again but Zeke Elliott I thought at times in last week's game he had a couple productive runs and actually he had a decent fantasy day with 10.80 fantasy points in PPR leagues with Zeke 10 carries 34 yards touchdown a catch four yards obviously his best days are behind him a lot of miles on his body for Zeke Elliott but still a running back that's capable of short yardage and goal line work at times so this Cowboy team they need to find new ways to generate offense because the game's They've lost this season to good teams that were down early and often and couldn't figure ways to run the football and get easier first down. Zeke right now available in 76% of fantasy leagues. And even with Dotto back, I believe he might get some work in this game. So that's a few running backs. I have his sleepers for week nine of the fantasy football season.